Hey everybody, welcome to this uh, radio channel. I wanted to talk about one of the aspects of our hobby that is a major problem, and it's noise. So here I'm uh, on Radio Vanna Cuba, and of course one of the things about um, what's happening with listening to shortwave is noise level. So what I do is um, go around my home. So basically what you want to do is tune a signal or tune the AM band and go around your home. You will find spots where the, the, the signals are better. You will find spots where the noise level is, is actually stronger. Of course, you don't want to be on a place where the noise level is strong. You want to try to get the stations. So by going around your home, you can actually help and listen in and see where the noise is stronger, maybe see where things are better. Um, in every home, there's always a spot somewhere where it's a little better than other, uh, other uh, places. But if you live in a, an apartment building, this is a complex thing. If you live in condos, it's also a very complex thing doing some shortwave listening in here. Unfortunately, there are some cases where you might need to actually go outside and you won't have any choices. But do go around your home and go next to devices. You know, you've got a big screen TV. Yes, a lot of beacon here. Uh, big screen TV. You've got any devices that are plugged in. Go and check out these little power adapters and, and switching power supplies. There's often sources of noise. And by going around with your radio near these devices, you might actually find out that, oh, all the noise that I have comes from one particular device. And maybe you can turn it off when you don't actually use it. So there are things like that that you can do. And I really, really think you should go around your home with a portable. If you don't have a portable shortwave, it doesn't matter. Take a little portable AM, FM receiver. Put it on AM because FM is, of course, less affected by noise. AM is much more affected. So go on a uh, you know the AM band and go around your home. You might even want to go outside if you have a home and you have you know uh, wonder where you can actually set up an antenna outside. Bring that radio outside with you and start listening to the noise levels around the yard, around the different areas. You might find that there's quiet places in your yard and there are places where you might not want to put up an antenna because of the higher noise level. But using a portable receiver is a great way to actually uh, find noise sources. And, uh, well, if all fails, yes, Mr. Paul is here sleeping. If all fails, you, uh, unfortunately, there are some cases where listening to shortwave means going outside and going to a park far away from homes. Uh, unfortunately, in a perfect world, it'd be fun to listen to shortwave everywhere. Like, you know, it's kind of cool, but unfortunately, it's not always the case. So this is a little tip for uh, beginners out there. One of the main reasons why you might not actually hear any stations is noise level around your home. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.